Hey guys, welcome to Fairy Wisdom. I am here to help you create a happy and healthy and wealthy life. Um, so, little vulnerability this morning. The energy right now is this feeling of wanting to just give up. Let it all go. Just everything that you've worked hard for, everything that you're dreaming of, everything that you know, things that even have been confirmed for you because they're not here, you're just wanting to give up. I felt that way this morning. Don't, because that is exactly when your breakthrough is there, okay? So it is so important that you do not give up right now. The energy is heavy right now family and um, it is I mean I can I can I know that it's heavy because I'm I can hear it in my voice I can feel it in my nose um, you know there's just this energy of people just wanting to just throw their hands up throw in the white flag and leave it up to the people that are already already doing it right? <laughs> we can't. We can't do that. Mm -mm. No, because like I said, right when you feel like you just want to give up, that is exactly when your breakthrough is about to show up for you. So please, I am asking you for today's daily channeled vlog message. Do not give up. When you don't want to do the things that you've been doing, you know what I'm saying? Consistency is key. And so there's got to be something that you are putting effort into every single day to create something. And when you wake up feeling like, what for? That is when you know. I'm telling you, that is when you should know, when you should recognize that you, you've you made it, okay? <laughs> it may not feel like it, but your patience has not gone unnoticed, okay? God, the universe wants you to know that because you have been so patient, because you never lost faith, and because you never gave up, and you handled every single Thing with grace and dignity and integrity your harvest is going to be bigger than you have imagined it okay and I also want to remind you all that um, this full moon okay this season of waiting is not quite over because the season hasn't changed yet. <laughs> I had to remind myself this this morning. I'm like, man, I know that this season, I know that I'm stepping into a new season. What is happening? This things aren't things aren't completely taking off like I want. That's the thing is, I want. <laughs> divine timing is everything and, and the new season hasn't technically started yet okay in just a few very short days so channel message here is make sure that during these last few very short days you are honoring yourself you're getting plenty of rest because in this new season you are going to be very busy you are going to be doing exactly what it is that you want to be doing. You are creating a new reality for yourself. And that season is very close. So understand that you didn't miss the train. You're on the train. Okay? You are on the train and the train is moving. And it's, it may be going at a slow pace right now, right? Chugga, 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 chugga. <laughs> That's 
that's what I heard. <laughs> but believe that in this next season, this is your season, family. Do not give up right now. Your breakthrough is here. Okay? We need you. It is important that you stay strong. Look at this random, can you see right here, this random stocking that showed up on my wall? <laughs> it was probably one of my kids, but I didn't put that there. <laughs> just one of the signs another sign that I know that this is it's not just for me it's for a collective okay one of my so I keep all of my decks in a window seal so that way they're constantly the energy is constantly being cleared out I keep my crystals one crystal on top of each deck okay one of my crystals has gone missing thank you fairies whatever you've done with it. <laughs> and when I noticed that the crystal was missing off the deck, two cards, okay? So I keep these decks lined up like one closest to the window seal and then one right next to it, right? So that way there's plenty of room on my, it's not a window seal, it's, it's a shelf that I have underneath the windows, okay? To create more space, okay? so closest to the window here, okay, outside of the window. So this one, there are, the crystal was missing, and there were two cards that had flown off, off of the, the top of the deck without all of the surrounding decks were not touched, okay? So what was left on top of that deck was the abundance card. The two cards that flew off were peace and relationships. Trust that you are creating solid relationships right now. Relationships that you can trust. Trust that the cycle of people who are trying to prevent you from getting where you're going, people who are not supporting you, people who do not give you an equal give and take, people who are just there to take, that cycle is over. Trust that you can be at peace right now. Peace is not something you should wait for. Peace is just something you should embody. Okay? When you have faith and you trust the process, Peace just comes naturally, okay? And trust that abundance is here for you. Whatever abundance that you've been manifesting, whether it be financial, um, love, um, I don't know, I feel like, woo, with this full moon, I feel like the new moon energy brought us into this acceptance of understanding that we are worth and it is okay to want abundance and to want material things. We are human, right? Now, it's not okay to, you know, obsess over those things or be attached to those things, but it is okay to want those things and we're coming into this energy of realizing that right of understanding that that's what the new moon brought in this full moon is going to bring in those things that you want because it's okay this life isn't meant to be poverty stricken right and if you have the finances now, then this is abundance for you in something else, right? Something else that you have been trying to create. But for me personally, it is finances. I was raised with a lack mentality. And so 
you know, I went, I went through all the different phases of, you know, releasing the attachment to money. And then now we are here, um, you know, at first it was working my ass off to barely survive, right? <laughs> and then it was uh, realizing that that's not what this life is meant to be like. And then it was releasing the attachment to money and having faith that I will always be taken care of. All of my needs and my wants will be met. Then it was, well, my needs are being met. Maybe I'm not allowed to want. And then it was, it's okay to want things, nice things. It's okay to provide extra abundance of things for my children. It's okay to have and want nice things and money. And I don't have to constantly give to get nothing back. Right? I do deserve to receive. And what I give is abundant in itself. And what you give, you get back. And so now we're stepping into, right? We've changed that whole cycle, kind of went around. I mean, then this has been over the last couple years, right? This, and so take this how it resonates with you. This could be a relationship. Uh, with, you know, romance, friendships, family, um, jobs, uh, you know, every, anything that you can think of. Understand the cycle that you've been through. Everything is going to make perfect sense to you very soon. There's going to be moments and downloads that you're just going to be like, oh, okay <laughs> or aha like no shit <laughs> so trust okay you haven't been brought in this far to just be dropped off right you didn't jump on the train to be dropped off right before the mother load okay <laughs> Do not give up. It is all about to make sense. And everything is going to come together perfectly. You've had faith this long. Don't lose it. Hang tight because we're almost there. Okay? The season is literally almost over in a few short days. And 13.13 on the clock. And that harvest moon is coming in. Okay? So, uh, that is what I have for you today. I will be back on in a little bit to do our daily tarot message. Uh, thank you so much. And together, we rise.